Yota is a great piece of technology. Why that? Well, I will try to point this out to you in the next minutes. Maybe you've already heard about Bitcoin, a virtual currency which can be used to transfer money across the globe within seconds, without banks and at low costs. Great, isn't it? Maybe you've also heard about smart devices such as smart TVs, smartphones, or even smart fridges. These devices make use of the internet and help you to live your life as conveniently as possible. Great, isn't it? We're in 2017 now. As you know, there is a lot of progress in today's technologies at an enormous speed. Big and small companies around the world spend millions of dollars on the next step in this respect. Imagine cars that can refuel on their own or fridges that automatically send the shopping list to the store and even pay for the delivery to come to your home. You can say that this technology, which is called the Internet of Things, will affect every device in the future. Great, isn't it? Now you may think, well, Bitcoin, which is fast and cheap, plus the Internet of Things, which needs a wallet for every device to pay the bills, is the perfect match. Actually, you are right. But there are also some problems with Bitcoin. The more transactions there are, the slower the network gets. Imagine all of our Internet of Things devices of the future doing transactions. That's a whole lot. But Bitcoin can only handle seven transactions per second. This means that it might take some minutes, if not hours, until your car can pay the bill for refueling. Quite annoying. And then there is a second problem. Every transaction with Bitcoin costs. At the moment, this rather seems not so much, but you'll have a real problem once billions of transactions worldwide are made. Who wants to pay this? This is where Yota unfolds its potential. With Yota, the network gets faster instead of slower with every transaction. Moreover, it can handle up to 1000 transactions per second, and probably even more in the future. Also, there aren't any costs for the transactions. And on top of that, Yota was designed from scratch in such a fashion that one Yota is of such a tiny piece of value that you can even pay the smallest amounts of money, which is really important when you think of machine-to-machine -machine payments that can be very large, but also very small. Yota is capable of handling all this. It has been developed for years and is now ready to hit the markets on June 13, 2017. With Yota, the next version of the Internet, the Internet of Things is possible. No transaction cost at maximum speed make things happen tomorrow which you cannot even imagine today. Great, isn't it?